world. I mean, a lot of a lot of people say, you know, I wish I could be there, but you know, having the opportunities, it takes the next step in dedication and sacrifice. You know, to know that making that team, you've worked hard your whole life and you know, put in the time and effort, and you know, definitely put on that jersey. You know, show your country what you can do, and you know, a lot of a lot of confidence and support that you've had growing up has come come out on top. It means everything, you know, to put that put that jersey on your back. Uh, you know, to wear the red and white. Not many kids get to do it, but. It's like winning a Stanley Cup, you know, you grow up uh, dreaming about it. Uh, it's definitely a huge part of my morals and, and values and, and both, my, both my parents, like I said, represented Canada and my brother also did. Um, so I was, I was the last one last summer to get that, that, get that chance, but um, to do it with under 20 World Juniors where it's kind of the, the nation thing, is, it would be really special. And, another chance to put that jersey on would be awesome. Yeah, it was always, it's always been one of my goals since I was younger. Um, I've always been around the Canadian flag because of my parents and um, so that really really motivated me to wear the jersey and just being able to put it on, that was a huge honor. It's pretty special. Um, you know, I feel very lucky and, and honored and privileged to, to be able to represent my country and uh, you know, not how many chances you're going to get, uh, you know, how many opportunities you're going to get to do that so you want to make the best of it and take advantage of it. So. It's, it's, it's unbelievable, it's a dream come true, it's something you dream of growing up and, and any chance you get, uh, you want to make the best of it, it's, it's pretty special.